If you're interested in learning Inkscape, you may already be familiar with the concept of vector graphics. There are three general categories of graphic software, each specializing in a particular type of artwork. There are artistic painting programs like Corel Painter, which simulate traditional painting. These require some level of artistic ability. Then there is software whose main function is photo manipulation. GIMP, Photoshop, and other similar programs fall into this category. Vector graphic software like Inkscape falls somewhere in between those two types. Unlike photo editing software, you'll create your own images from scratch in Inkscape, but you don't need to be a great artist in order to create pretty impressive vector artwork. The graphics are built upon shapes, lines, and curves that you create using the Inkscape tools. Since Inkscape is free, you can learn vector graphics without having to buy expensive software. And a huge advantage of vector graphics is that they can be scaled to any size without losing image quality. This thorough and detailed course is divided into 29 sections covering every Inkscape tool and the major functionality of the software. A graphic assignment is provided for each of those 29 sections. In the early part of the course, you may find yourself frustrated by not being able to make the tools do what you want them to do. But if you stick with it, soon you'll find yourself mastering their use, and that's when things start to become fun. The last section of the course consists of a major final project. You'll duplicate the image of a fictional game board. In this last section, the elements of the game board are covered in 20 separate lessons. Students will create each of those elements one at a time. After viewing all the lessons and completing each assignment, your vector graphics skills should be well developed and you should have the confidence to tackle your own design projects.